Hello everyone, my name is Shreesh Prasad, I study in 7th grade in Euro School Eroli and today's topic is Google Maps. So before I move on, I just want to give a brief about Google Maps. So Google Maps was released in February 2005 and is a web mapping service developed by Google. So first I'll just open Google Maps. So to open Google Maps, you can just put the link maps.google.com and when you click enter, Google Maps opens up. So let's move on with the pointer. So the first one is add your home address. So to do that, I'll just type uh, just type home. And then uh, this will come. So you, you will just click set location. And then uh, select, uh, select where you stay. So and then when you click save, uh, home will be uh, updated and then whenever if you want like from directions from your home to school then the, uh, when you type home the location will be set the location you have entered and the school you will have to enter it yourself or you can preset it so the next one is search for your favorite place on google maps so my favorite place is Pawai. so i just type Pawai. the next part is Create a Google Doc file and copy the quick facts and place it into the file. So at first I'll just copy this by uh, pressing Ctrl C. Then I'll open the Google Docs file. So for that first I have to open Google Docs, which I can access by typing the link docs.google.com. Then I'll click a blank document. Then I'll paste the information by pressing Ctrl V and then I'll uh, name it as let's say my favorite place. So now the next one is get directions from, uh, about your school, get directions from your school from your uh, house from driving. So first for that I'll just enter my school's address. So. So this is the one. Then I click this directions icon. Then I'll choose the starting point as home. And as you can see. And then as you can see, uh, we have uh, three we, uh, we have three directions like from via Mullen, uh, Early Road from via Mullen, Early Road and um, Early Knowledge Park and via Vando Village Road. And uh, also, we can just switch uh, switch the starting point and the destination from here. So the next one is um, add another destination in the map to create a route with multiple destinations. Show details of the route. So for that, I'll just click add another destination or add destination icon, and then let's say Gateway of India. Hence, so I'll just get um, I'll get from my Mullen, so I'll just click details. Then I have uh, different details like from how, from where, like walk southwards, and uh, it's showing walk because I've not selected the option of uh, from car, and as you can see, it's in walking. So if I click driving, it will take me less time, and uh, as it's showing that this route has tolls. So when I just click uh, details, then it will show all the details from like from where and how should I go there. The next one is look for the gateway of India in Google Maps. So to do that, I'll just go back and I'll cancel this. And I'll search gateway of India. As you can see the suggestions. And as you can see, it has taken me to the gateway of India, the curve. So the next one is, uh, look for the street view of gateway of India. So for that, I just click this icon. And as you can see, there are blue spots have, that have appeared everywhere. And to see the gateway of India, I just drag this to the certain blue point. 
as you can see this this green circle should be there on the blue point so that i can get a perfect street view and then it changes to a 3d mode of the street view and then you can see how does it look there and these photos and paranormal Paranoma photos are uploaded by uh, people and not by Google employees. So let me move on. So uh, CD 3D view of any one image. So first I'll just come out of this. So I'll just click these photos. And then I'll, I'll look for a 3D photo. So as you can see a 3D photo is marked by this uh, rotation symbol so if i click this it's 3d photo so i'll just click this and then i have everything like shift as this is aerial so it's showing like this so if, if it's like and uh, that's how you view 3d photos so let me just go back So now let's move on with the next one. So the next one is um, look for the uh, look for the nearby restaurants of Gateway of India. So I'll just search Gateway of India again. Then I'll search nearby, and they already have some uh, suggestions like restaurants nearby, hotels nearby, or bar and pubs nearby. And you can also search for different stuff too. So I'll just click restaurants nearby, and then it will show different. Uh, results of the restaurants near uh, Gateway of India. So the next part is that in your contributions, add one image. So to do that, I'll just search the place first. So Gateway of India. Sorry. Then I click this photo. Then as you can see, the add I add a photo icon is present. So I'll just click this. And then uh, we have three options like upload, photos from phone and your photos. So I'll just click uh, choose photos to upload. Then I'll select the photo. Then I'll click open. Then after uploading it will show a pop up that share more, thank you for sharing and done. Like a dialog box, a small dialog box in the middle. As, I, as you can see it is appeared here I told you before then I just click done and I'll be sent back here so let me move on with the next topic the next one is measure distance between Nariman point and gateway of India so first just let me uh, search Nariman point so I'll just do a left click here then I'll click measure distance then I'll go to gateway of India as you can see, I've just measured the difference, uh, uh, distance, sorry, which is 1.15 kilometers, like from middle of uh, of Nariman Point to middle of Gateway of India. So, thank you.